program. Now Liam Fierce looking to match some points here. Liam Fierce. Been a contender the last few years. Skated in Sochi, of course, with Team Canada at the Olympics. Well, he has so much talent, but uh, like Roman, struggles with the triple axle. Blues for Kluke, choreographed by Mark Pillay. It's going to open here with a quad toe. And not a bad attempt at all. He will get credit for rotating that jump and staying on his feet. Now you can see cautiously here approaching his triple axle. Again, that is a good attempt for Liam. But all the talk about quads in the world, the triple axle is a must make. You have to. It's the only thing he needs. Watch the line, the detail, musicality. He has the spins and the speed. Final jumping pass, triple combination, triple lots and turn out, triple toe. Just the missing axle. Such a critical jump. Liam Ferris need, knows he needs it. Yes, but for Liam, it, it, he did what he's capable of out there today with the step out on the quad and the step out on the axle. He got up straight in the air. He doesn't have the confidence yet on those jumps. He needs to fight harder for the landing. Nam is next. Number one at every level imaginable. It's crazy. And he did it quickly. He did it quickly. He's only 17. <laughs> so Liam Ferris. With his coach, Christy Crawl, she's talking him through the program. Here's his quad. Nice and straight. Didn't fight. Didn't, just didn't check out on the landing. And that's just not confident with that jump. The triple axle. Little bit slow going in. Again, there was no check out. He, uh, he just was able to rotate it. So obviously he's going to lose marks on the wall. Uh, three points on the, on the first one, three on the second. 78.87 well, seconds, so he moves ahead of Kevin Reynolds, and some of you might wonder why that is the case. Now, Kevin Reynolds skated earlier, he also had some mistakes, so you add up some of the mistakes or the inability to get points.